but Thomas didn't like me. We were both drivers at this pizza place and I drove a van and he drove like a little white car. Both of us had shitty cars. And he lived in an apartment with like his uh, Native American girlfriend who was like six feet tall. And he was like five feet, like barely over five feet tall. So it was like an odd couple they looked. And um, we watched the NBA finals there, the Lakers play the Nets. And he was from Los Angeles and liked the Lakers. And he would just talk so much shit like uh, over and over and just did not like me and did not like the Spurs and did not like San Antonio and would just talk crap. And uh, during those finals, I, I, w- I predicted that the Lakers would sweep the Nets. And he's like, they won't sweep them. Uh, and then I was right about that. They ended up sweeping them that year. And uh, we had like a $20 bet. And then since I liked the Spurs and he liked the Lakers, that was the last game of the season. So he paid me that $20. Or no, he didn't pay me that $20. He's like, how about double or nothing? Well, let's bet on the uh, n- next year's championship. If the Lakers win, I'll you give me $100. And if the Spurs win, I'll give you $100. And I was like, okay, that's a bet. Or he's like, I'll give you $120 to make up for the 20 that I already won, that I I had already won. So I'm like, okay. And that was in 2002. So then 2003, I'm just watching the uh, Spurs the whole uh, season. I talk about it in my book, Gonzo Education. And uh, when the Spurs win their uh, second championship in 2003, and during the whole season, I have that on the back of my head. Oh, Thomas, look out. The Spurs are have one of the best records. Look out. The Spurs have a great team. You know, I'm just thinking, you're going to owe me $100, and there's not anything you can do or say about it. And um, <clears throat> at the end of that season, the Lakers did not win the championship. The San Antonio Spurs won the championship. And uh, I, Thomas left town. He left the job at the Bits and Pizzas. And he left uh, Austin, San Antonio, and he went to California, even though he had like warrants or some shit. He was like a shorter skater dude. And uh, he left town and never paid me the $120, even though I, I totally straight out won. And then I remember like I was in a city like in Phoenix or, or something like that. And like I had dr- driven by him and he was like on a skateboard and I saw him and uh I'll never forget him, but he saw me and he's like, oh shit. And he like got scared because he knows he owes me that $120. But I don't, it's not about the money. I just want him to admit that that's the most unmanly thing to do. Like he didn't admit he was wrong. He didn't admit he lost the bet. He just left town. But and so I've always like, oh, but I fucking won that. San Antonio Spurs won the fucking championship in 2003. So 